Hi and welcome to Tech Lightning. In today's episode we have something very exciting, very cool. We're going to see the differences between a forward and a reverse proxy. So let's get into it. What is a proxy server? Let's put the terminology out there. There's a forward proxy and a reverse proxy. A proxy server is any device that translates network traffic between network or protocols. That's the basic definition. Now a proxy server can also have additional functionality such as traffic inspection and URL whitelisting. But strictly speaking, that's not required in order to fall under the category of being a proxy. Why do we care about proxy servers? Well, most home users don't care about proxy servers. There's more fun stuff in life. You may want to spend your time thinking of your holiday or how the next Matrix movie will turn out. But proxy servers are very important to our corporate overlords. You see, every company more or less has a forward proxy server. Wait, hold up! What exactly is a forward proxy server? Without this, most of you wouldn't be able to browse Reddit or watch YouTube during working hours. See, I have your attention now. Here is your absolutely favorite place, the office. At the office, there is a network, which we will call the corporate network. Imagine there is no proxy server. You try to open up YouTube, and what do you get? You get the dreaded, page cannot be displayed. Now why would this be the case? Well, no security worth its salt would want everyone full access to the internet from the corporate network. Therefore, we introduce a forward proxy. With this forward proxy, Let's see what happens when you try to open up YouTube. Your request is first sent to the forward proxy. If it's a modern proxy, it will also do a lot of tasks in the name of security, such as checking is YouTube access allowed. Then it will forward your request and be your spokesperson towards the YouTube servers. Now that we've covered forward proxies, let's focus on the elephant in the room, or more specifically, the reverse proxy. A reverse proxy also sits between a network and its internal resources. However, it works in the opposite direction compared to a forward proxy. Instead of sending requests out to the internet, it accepts connections from the internet and forwards them to its internal servers or applications. In this case with YouTube, Google may have a reverse proxy to direct your requests to its internal servers. Thanks for watching. I hope you learned something so you can take it with you into your next call or if you want to impress that special someone. Until next time, thanks a lot and see you.